Some whiskeys are really difficult or challenging to describe. This one, I'll describe it in two words. Buy it. Welcome to another episode of Eric Way Whiskey Studies. And in this video, I'm gonna review the Red Breast 12 year old cash strength and absolutely superb whiskey. In fact, I gotta say, this is thus far in my uh, study of Irish whiskeys is really the top notch. In fact, I like this better than the Middleton Very Rare Cast. And I can get three of these for the price of one of those. And yet, of course, without the fancy wood box and all that. But an absolutely fantastic whiskey that I, I liked from uh, the neck pour. It was fantastic, you know, straight from the neck pour, but it gets even better as you get past the shoulder. Now, like the 12 year old, it has some very similar notes, it has a similar profile, and yet everything is turned up to 11. It is much, much more intense. So on the nose, I get this like this apple pie and cinnamon character. There's that rich, rich, rich buttery character vanilla, cinnamon, uh, nutmeg. There's both sort of the red apple and your green apple, so maybe your red delicious and your green Granny Smith. So it has both of the sweeter component and that slight uh, more tart component on the nose. This one, much more than the 40% bottle, really jumps up out of the glass. And on the palate, oh my goodness. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. And the finish on this, the length of this finish is really, really, really long. Before I give you my notes on the palate, here are my notes about this whiskey. The Red Best Cast Drink was distilled at Middleton Distillery. It is triple distilled in copper pot stills. It contains malted and unmalted barley. It was aged in bourbon and cherry cast for a minimum of 12 years. It is non-chill filtered, has natural color. It is bottled at 59.9% alcohol by volume, and I bought this bottle for $67 here in the United States. So you take a sip of this, and you can sit there literally for probably 15 minutes and still taste it. I find not only it has a great entry, mid palate, and finish, and, and then follow through, but even as it starts to fade a little bit, and I'm talking now, I'm still tasting it, I do this thing where I kind of, I don't do it on camera. I usually, I usually do I do this kind of smacking in the lips. It sort of like uh, refreshes or sort of revives that uh, remnant of what is uh, uh, still lingering on the palate. It kind of brings it up more. And what I get on the finish is a lot of that spice, the bigness, the cinnamon, the nutmeg, uh, loads of vanilla. The texture of this whiskey, it is silky. And this is, I think, what is really sells, probably even across the board for, for Irish whiskeys as a category, is the silkiness. And if you put this on ice, and trust me, this will take a couple ice cubes and not lose any of the deliciousness of the flavor. Put this on ice cube, it then takes on a, a different component where it becomes a little bit more um, creamy and vanilla pudding. Right now, it's silky, but if you put it on ice, it becomes more creamy, it comes a little bit, a little bit thicker, and becomes a little bit more almost like uh, uh, melted ice cream. That's what it is, not vanilla. It's like melting ice cream on your palate. Absolutely delicious. And on a hot day, and we've got 110 degree temperatures uh, here in, in, in August 2020, uh, you really need and want a couple ice cubes. They're absolutely superb, and it'll do just fine. Now, the price on this isn't much more than the 40% uh, ABV bottle. You know, maybe five, 10 bucks, of course, it might be different uh, where you're at versus where I'm at. Um, but looking, at, you know, looking online, looking across the market, different states and different places, it still seems to be uh, within arm's reach of the 40% alcohol by volume. So uh, if you can get a bottle of this, I gotta say, my recommendation is buy it, buy it. And if, if you've got the money, if you have the availability, right, 
I highly, highly, highly recommend buying this whiskey. Alrighty, um, if you like my videos, you like my reviews, I wanna ask that you subscribe if you haven't already. And if you wanna subscribe, please ring the bell to be notified when I go live or uh, post a new video. And if you are one of my Patreons, I wanna thank you much for joining my little group. And until next time, cheers.